All right, guys, hey, thanks for coming back and checking out the channel. And this is the moment that a lot of you have been waiting for. We're going to get the old girl out and see if we can't figure out where that leak is coming from. Let's get to it. Welcome to Hidden Valley Homestead, where my wife Olivia and I escaped the city to homestead our off-grid property in Idaho. This is our journey. All right, guys, so this is the moment a lot of you guys have been waiting for, and I've been talking about this for forever, and uh, the old girl's got a leak, a hydraulic leak somewhere, and I'm crossing my fingers and hoping that it's not a cracked case. So we're gonna dive under this thing. Well, we're gonna get it up off the ground first and see what uh, see what we got. We gotta pull the bottom plates off. Got my kids here to help me out and uh, enjoy the footage, you guys. So uh, let's check this out. Let's see if this old girl fires up. She's been sitting here for, she's been sitting here all winter long. And uh, let's see here. Give it a little bit of RPMs. Turn it on. I still got battery? No way. Wow. Yeah. She's burning like a kid. Look at that. Yeah, the old girl's been sitting here all winter long. Let's get this old girl going. This old girl, she just runs. What? Danae, will you get a hammer and take these nails out? Nathan, we're gonna put these right on the tracks. There's some in the bucket, Danae. Right there. Yep. Where's the bucket? Right here, in the blue one. Oh, this one's. There's gonna be more on the center. There you go. That's, that's gonna work, yeah. Nice and curly. Take them out? Yep, how take the nails take, out. How am I gonna take them out? With the hammer. Okay, Nate, this one too? Yeah. 
Oh, this is light. Yeah. Let's have it beside it while she's doing that. Maybe get the other one. This one works too, didn't it? Go all the way to your end. Sweet. All right. That's about 20 inches, maybe 18 inches or so. That'll be enough room to get underneath here. I'll put a tarp down or a piece of cardboard. And uh, yeah, that'll give me somewhere to work. Okay, here we go. Am I perfectly straightly lined up? Because I cannot turn once I'm up there. Yeah, but you need to go forward and then right where you are, you're like lined up. I mean, it'll, 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 it's not going to go anywhere, but um, I would have preferred to have that log a little more centered. I feel safe. This is chained up, so that's not going to fall on me. You should put some jacks under or something. Okay. I think we're good, guys. Man, I've been wanting to get underneath this thing forever. It's, it's not going to fall Watch in, your head, Dad. watch your head. Oof. Oof. That's close. Come on, guys, let's check this out. Hi, Barry. Is there jacks or anything to put in the middle? It's got two giant walls. Yeah, it's not going nowhere. Oh, this is so cool. I've been wanting to see underneath here forever. Oh, yeah. This is so cool. Look at, uh, I wanted to see this undercarriage underneath here so bad. Hey guys, look at these chains. These chains are in great shape. The rails, these rails are in great shape as well. This is fantastic. All right, all right guys, well I'm gonna, a little more sightseeing here. And looking at these pins, these pins are in great shape. These arms, man. Guys, I scored on this dozer. This old girl's in great shape. These pins are great. All the insides of the rollers are in good shape. Oh, this is beautiful. Loving it. Loving it. Oh, the chains are in good shape. This is fantastic. Good stuff. All right, guys. All right, guys. I've been dreaming about this for a couple years. I know I've been promising you guys for a long time that I'm going to get underneath here and get this thing... Uh, Get this bottom belly pan out and see where where the leak is coming from. But yeah. Um, okay, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. All right, so I got to take that bolt, that bolt, and then let's see here. I'm trying to see where else. This looks like the drain plug for the transmission, and that's well, that's the transmission. This would be the reverser right here. And you guys never been underneath one of these things. And then that thing, those are riveted together. So I've got those front bolts. And there you go, guys. You can see the leaks coming from right there up in front. Uh, maybe have a little bit of an engine leak here, but that's pretty normal. So uh, this pan is gonna be heavy. But I've gotta undo those four bolts right there. And, uh, oh no, maybe not. 
Okay, so these bolts right here, I wonder if those are bolts on the inside. I hope those aren't nuts on the inside because that means that I've got to take off this front pan first and uh, that's going to be a pain in the neck. I've got three I've got three big bolts right there on each side of this front pan. And then this pan, this pan will come off. Huh. Interesting. I'll bet those are bolted together. Holy smokes. So this whole thing's got to come off in one in one big piece. All right. Well, this is this is going to be a pain in the neck to do. No, not in your life. She does this to me all the time. She tells me how to do every little thing sometimes, oh, and she doesn't know. know how to do I it see, herself. I see, I see her do that. Honey, why don't you do this? Honey, why don't you do oh, that? Oh, yeah, great idea. Well, she has great thoughts sometimes, but other times sometimes. she doesn't know what she's doing, and she's telling me how to do it when she doesn't know what she's doing. Same thing I, I do with Vince. What'd you say? You're supposed to be our helpmates. And I am. And making suggestions. She's been getting better. She has been like, what if you we do this, honey? We make suggestions. So she, and she, she and half so, the time you guys don't listen to us. Good. It's well, good. Half the time you're wrong. Well, half the time we're right. That's only 50 50. Awesome. I like well, half odds. the time you're wrong too. So. 50 50? 50 50? I'll take those odds. This is pretty good odds. <laughs> okay, so now we got the old girl up on the stilts. Everybody's all panicking and scared, but she ain't going anywhere. I got myself a couple of feet of clearance now. I got plenty of room to work underneath there. So, so yeah, at some point I'll probably make me a better ramp, but for now, this will do. So, hey guys, we're going to get to it. The OSHA was here, they would have shut it down. Yeah, right? safety third. If OSHA was here, no, there's no OSHA in Idaho. 